Taylor Swift celebrates her B-Day early and receives another award nomination. Yeah, plus two of hip-hop's heavyweights have teamed up for a monumental mixtape. Ooh, sounds cool. Our heat tracker has all the info you need from hip-hop to rock. Click the fuse.tv slash T10 link. Do it. All right, so uh, Taylor Swift, she's having a pretty insane week, and it's not even Friday yet. So true. While hanging out in Australia, she won three awards at the American Country Awards, and that was on Tuesday night. Huh. And that same night, in a time zone far, far away, uh, those adoring fans gave her an early birthday gift. She tweeted this, Perth, insane crowd, when you randomly all started singing happy birthday, well played, smiley face. <laughs> now, all you Swifties are well aware that Taylor's B-Day is tomorrow, and this morning, Taylor took to Twitter to further explain her time warp. She tweeted, it would appear that I'm now 24. That's on Australia time, though, still 23 in the States, but I just can't believe the woman's only 24 years old. She kind of rules the world. Pretty much. I mean, I, I personally love a woman who can celebrate her birthday in different worldly time zones. That's I think you cool. personally love everything Taylor Swift does. Th that's also very true. That too. Now, the Golden Globe nominations were announced this morning, and as fate would have it, Taylor's track Sweeter Than Fiction is nominated for Best Original Song. Huh. Yeah, Lena Dunham of Girls sent out a congratulatory message to Taylor Swift and co-writer slash boyfriend Jack Antonoff. Also so happy for at Taylor Swift 13, at Jack Antonoff, who wrote my favorite song of the year. You will never guess which one is my lover. Hmm, my money's on Swift. Now, what a week, and it's not even Friday, which is officially Taylor's born day. <laughs> so uh, what are your plans for Taylor's birthday? I, of course, I'm going to be listening to her song all day while trying to score tickets to her next concert. No big deal or anything. Uh, but tweet us your plans, at T10, at Trident Gum, and use the hashtag Chew on this. Do it. Now, I think I know what rapper Busta Rhymes is going to be doing, probably celebrating the release of his highly anticipated mixtape with a tribe called Quest member Q-Tip. Huh. Uh, Busta, who was apparently counting the minutes to its release, he tweeted out this exciting Instagram picture. It's finally here. Hashtag the abstract and the dragon. Get it now. Yep, now the collaborative effort features features huge names such as Missy Elliott, Wu-Tang Clan member Raekwon, and of course, their current single, Thank You, featuring Kanye West and Lil Wayne. Yeah, sounds like a pretty good listen. Yeah. Be sure to watch Trending 10 tonight, 7-6 Central, only on Fuse.